Oh, I don't know if I'm an, should be an expert talking about Lori Cabot, but I'll tell you who I think Lori Cabot is. Um, I think Lori Cabot is one of the more courageous witches that um, I've known. Uh, I remember being really young, early 90s, watching Unsolved Mysteries, and she was on an episode where uh, she was implored by the local um, authorities to help find, I think it was a serial killer or somebody, somebody did something really bad, it was on the run and they couldn't catch him. And I remember seeing this wild, white-haired woman dressed in robes with tattoos and jewelry, and she sat down and she cast this amazing spell to, to stop this perpetrator in their tracks and to be caught by the police, and it happened. And it was probably one of the most amazing things as a really young child to see, to see a witch doing good, not some, heckled green warty you know conical hat wearing person that some this this being did was a is a force of good and a force of of, of support and healing um so Lori cabot to me although I, I believe she has the title is you know like the the witch queen of salem um i think she is one of our elders that really did pave the way for visibility and as that since she is a um, she's a force to be reckoned with just from her identity and her name alone. Whether people like her or not, she's done a lot of work for the community. And I think what she does uh, as a witch, how she presents herself, her teachings, and her cohesiveness of keeping Salem in our modern sense alive is extremely vital.